FBI Special Counsel Robert Mueller could hand in his report into allegations members of the Trump campaign conspired with Russia to influence the 2016 U.S. presidential election as early as next week, according to reports on Wednesday. As that report was hypothesized about, Donald Trump's former confidant, the flamboyant political consultant Roger Stone, appeared in court after posting an image on Instagram appearing to threaten a U.S. district judge overseeing his criminal trial, itself instigated by Mr. Mueller's investigation. The judge, who he repeatedly apologized to, then issued a full gag order on him and warned him that he would not be given another chance to keep his freedom as he awaits trial. House Democrats will meanwhile file a resolution tomorrow against Mr. Trump's controversial decision to declare a national emergency over illegal immigration from the southwestern border in order to bypass Congress and get his wall built. As all of that Washington drama swirled, Mr. Trump weighed in on a number of issues on Thursday, including the case of Empire actor Jesse Smollett, who was charged in Chicago on Thursday for filing a false police report. What about MAGA and the tens of millions of people you insulted with your racist and dangerous comments, the president tweeted, referring to Smollett's claims that he was attacked by two men who told him he was in MAGA country, referring to the president's popular slogan. Chicago police have said that Smollett's attack was staged and orchestrated by the actor. The White House also detailed on Thursday the president's upcoming trip to Vietnam where he will have his second summit with North Korean leader Kim Jong-un. That summit is scheduled for next week.